Unaware that he was a violent felon and local rapper named Big Wacko. He is known for rapping about selling drugs and even created Big an- Big Wacko, that's his name. Big Wacko. I just suck it deep for a rock. I don't shit cold shit. I'ma tell it like it is. Wonder why you still broke, cause you don't stand no big. Oh, boy, yeah. this shit never see some shit with these eyes. Late night on the stove, send out only white pie. Hey, y'all nigga, if y'all know who this nigga is, man, comment down below, bro. Nope. Oh. Tase this big ass. Mikey, drop the gun! Drop the gun! Tase you, Mike! Oh my god. That's why his big ass fell in the beginning, because they tased him. That's why he fell like that. Put your hands behind your back! Hands behind your back! Put all of my electrolytes in his body. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Hands behind your back. I'm screaming. Shit ain't no good. Feels miserably from this OD, man. Not from this with one hand, but two, bro. We back here with another video. Oh, fuck. Back here with another video, man. You feel me? I already know how these shits go, man. Y'all already know what y'all reacting to. Not reacting to. Watching from the title. Well, I'm reacting to, actually. And shit, yeah, man. We got 400 pound rapper tries to run from offices after dropping his pole, my nigga. If you don't know what pole means, it means. I mean, pole, my nigga. You know, you know. If you know, you know, type shit. But I ain't gonna waste no time. Yeah, man, make sure I like, subscribe, comment, show love to your boy. Ain't gonna take shit out y'all day. You ain't gonna take no money out of your pocket. Any of that. It's just showing love. Cause you know I rock with y'all, so rock. Fat nigga hit the car on his head. Hey, buddy, back. On May 5th, 2021. Police officers in Orange County got a tip about a car that seemed to be involved in a live drug too. deal near a school. They received a description of the suspicious vehicle. While they, they were- They might have to look the nigga up too. If he got, they throw his rap name in here. It's funny, it's only right we gonna watch this video, my nigga. Like, whatever, he, whatever content, whatever music, whatever he got. It's a 10 minute video, but we might have to scratch the shit because of that. But if we do, we do. On you know, alert, you know the officer spotted the car in question. Passion's moving around a lot. Alright y'all, so they say it's a suspicious drug deal or some shit. The nigga probably moving some dope. Some weed. Nine times out of ten is probably weed. I'm saying dope. No mind me. I'll be on some book. I'll be on some shit. But he probably definitely selling some weed or some shit. You never know, or some pills. Shit, he probably even selling some crap. Hey doing? Good. Can you roll us all the way down? During the traffic stop, officers asked the passenger for identification. Unaware that he was a violent felon and local rapper named Big Wacko. He is known for rapping about selling drugs and even created Big an- Big Wacko, that's his name. Big Wacko. If y'all know who this nigga is, man, comment down below, bro. Album called Crack School, where he instructs his fans me. on how to sell drugs and evade the police. Mm -hmm. He's right here. Okay. Okay. Alright. Fucker pulled up his ID and shit all on his phone, bro. So you know this nigga been pulled over thousands and thousands of times. Right in the border. What's that? Where y'all headed to? I'll see you soon, sir. Okay. Read me your number off there. Uh, thirty-six, twenty-three. Hold on. There's a yeah. What's the what's the letter first? His background that's crazy bro he sat there wrote the nigga whole identification down and then the whole time the person that's filming the operator whatever that's on the back end they were sitting there listening to this nigga while he was giving the number out so the cop ain't gotta do shit the nigga just sit right there in patrol while they running everything in the back right at the site shit crazy this your truck big nigga ain't going how long you had it friday friday 
Oh my god, and he went to Poppy too, he went a Mexican. Oh yeah, they moved to the Okay, cool. Yeah, some cartel shit. What year is it? To the studio? Right over here on the No, I said what year is it? Oh, it's uh, 07. 07? I don't know. I mean, uh, last weekend, right? We was at, uh, what's the shit called? What's the club down here? Um, right here? Not this one. The one up on the road. Right here the Temple. <laughs> no, not the one where they had the fight night. It's the one way down. It's like an half hour. Right? Cop dog. Fucking GD ski mask. Yeah, I'm going to move on the uh, Virginia side. Cop dog. You said uh, right? Is that? Do me a favor. Step out for me. Step back here for me. Just right in the back. Step around the back of you, Carmen. Man, on as big as shit, you can tell he can make it a little bit. What's that? No. Spread your legs. Spread your legs. Oh! Tase this big ass. Mike, you dropped a gun! You dropped a gun! <laughs> this big nigga ain't getting nowhere. Please stop getting on the ground! Please stop getting on the ground! Please stop getting on the ground! Tase him, Mike. Oh, my God. Oh, That's why his big ass fell in the beginning, because they tased him. That's why he fell like that. Put your hands behind your back. Hands behind your back. Put all of my electrolytes in his body. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Hands behind your back. Hear him screaming? Shit ain't no good. Go get the car. Yeah, can you get your PR car? Yeah, we can. Ah! Nate, no. ah! Is that his pants on his socks up right there? Put your hands behind your back. Charlie, it's a six nine security. I told y'all, bro, these motherfucking cops be out of shape, bro. He barely was sitting there running and chasing after this nigga, bro. But he's out of shape. He out of breath, too. How the fuck is these cops out of breath? Are y'all supposed to be running at night, my nigga? What? If they came up to a fast nigga running, they is not catching them, bro. He barely was catching this nigga. Do you think he going to catch somebody that really do this shit? That got hot fences and all? This fucking caught more out of breath than the nigga on the floor. Give me a cuss. Headquarters, we're over. Detaining one, J-Y. Give me a hand. Response for Are you guys 10-4? Yeah, we're 10-4. County's out with us. He's securing the driver. We're 10-12 across the street with the he dropped his zero and tried to jump in another yeah, car. Yeah, hold on. That's why the nigga Unrelated. trying to get a run. Copy that. So you guys are 10-4, right? We're 10-4. If uh, someone can get with County, I think he's detaining the driver right now. You all right? Are you okay? Yeah, we're all in traffic. Sit up. You okay? What happened? Well, you got tased. Oh, when, you ran, when you ran from and the gun fell out of your pants. What gun? This one right here. It's not my gun. It's right on my camera, buddy. Uh, I felt I yeah, I stupid. it. You ran, happened, it fell out of your pants. Well, it may not be yours, but it's on you. It wasn't on me. Okay. You can figure that out later. That one, man, my gun. <laughs> 
That wasn't my gun. I don't care if it was yours or not. It was in your pants. Figure that out. That wasn't in my pants. Okay. That was not my gun. That was not my gun. First thing. Girl, what the fuck? These niggas was out here at the date. Oh, wow. it was dawn time, so they still out there. Um, before I ask yeah, you any questions about what happened, this isn't like an interview from Sergeant DTA? Scott about the use of force. We're talking about the actual criminal daytime. actions of what, what's going on. All right, I'm gonna read you your rights. Um, and after that, if you decide to talk to me, we can talk. All right. Have you ever been read your rights before? No. You ever been arrested before? Okay. You have the right to remain silent. Do you understand that? Mm -hmm. Just give me a verbal yes or no. Yes, sir. All right. Anything you say may be used against you in court. Do you understand? Yes. You have the right to talk to a lawyer before and during questioning. Do you understand yes, that? You cannot afford a lawyer and want one. One will be provided to you before question before questioning without charge. Do you understand? You threw me off. Has anyone promised you or threatened you? Has anyone threat be threatened or promised you anything to get Damn. you to talk to me? They got the Mexican Has anyone too, threatened you or promised you shit. anything to get you to talk to me? Damn. Okay. What's my charge well, we'll talk about it. All right. The gun that fell out of your pants. It's on camera. My partner was searching you. The gun fell out. You ran. Okay. Let's talk about this. Why'd you run? I thought I had a warrant. You thought you had a warrant. For what? For what's the name? For a grand theft. Okay. So the gun that's on camera coming out of your pants is not your gun. Man, I ain't had no gun coming out of your pants. You didn't have a gun. Yeah. Cool. The cell phone box in the car. You got a cell phone? No, nah, I just I got a cell phone, but that didn't work. What kind of phone you got? I got an iPhone. iPhone. Okay. Where's your phone at? Right there? Will you give us consent to look at the serial number for that phone? Yeah. We can match it up to the boxes in the car? Yes. That's not gonna be your phone? No. Or your box? No. No? No. Okay. Even if someone saw you with that box earlier? No. No? That's not mine. Okay, so the gun that fell out of your pants is not yours. And the box, the cell phone box is not yours. The cell phone yours. box is not mine. No. Okay. Even if, even if it just had a bunch of money, you don't want that money. No. Okay. Where's your phone at? My phone's right there. You can check the cell number and all that. That's not mine. There's some shit in there. How they gonna match the box with the iPhone? You said I can check the cell number? I don't know. That's what he did is going to his men that he was driving with. So he basically throwing that poppy nigga under the bus at this point. He's saying everything ain't his. So if it ain't yours, my nigga, it's his. The other nigga, so somebody got to take the You don't want to open it? Thank you. No, but it's all the shit done. Okay. All right, is there anything you want to tell me about what happened today? You only ran because you're in a war. He's pulled leave. He's going to drop out of his pocket. Okay. All right. The passenger was charged with carrying a concealed weapon and possession of cocaine as a convicted felon. He was sentenced to probation, hey, but violated the term soon after. He won't be teaching any of his crack tutorials anytime soon. Anyway, we've also added a bonus clip of him pleading with officers for a bond. Thanks for watching. Oh, oh, I'm just, I'm 375. You're a big boy. I just want to spend my leg, but I can't Man, they, they said 400 pound, you know, 400 pound rapper, you only 375. Oh, yeah. okay. My partner said you ran up about the, about the coat. Oh well, shit, he's saying he 375. He probably put his ass on the scale and he came with 400, but shit. We don't know. I appreciate it. That's all we, that's all we needed. How's your other leg? You want to get all the way out? Good. Don't fall. Yeah. Just sit back, on, sit back, sit back, Brown. Come here, Brown. All I want to ask is just, I leave him. All I want is a bun. Tell him to get out. I'll help you. That's all I'm asking, bro. Right. What's going on with Coke? Yeah. Let me get a bun. Let me get a bite of him. We can make some moves. 